Hey guys, so I'm doing this today. Um, I'm turning this one-piece swimsuit into a two-piece swimsuit with no sewing. All you need is Fabri-Tac, um, and you can get that at Michael's. Um, I bought mine from Amazon, so it's awesome. Um, I'll have the name of it down below just so that you guys can use it if you wish. Um, it's super simple. It took me maybe about four hours in total, but I spread it. I did it over a couple days. Um, so anyway, I really hope you guys enjoy the video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Okay, so I'm going ahead here and I am making sure the seam is where I want it to be for the top. Um, and making sure that... I have enough to fold over onto itself for a clean line instead of having scissor marks. Um, my cuts were, were fairly messy um, <laughs> and because I'm folding it down twice onto itself, I didn't worry about that. Of course, you can definitely do anything else you wish. You can, um, you know, use tape measures or whatever, but I didn't go ahead and, uh, do that. So, I am just cutting that along, and under the floral part, there is a white, um, interior. So, there's the white interior and the floral shell. What I went ahead and did was I folded down the white interior onto itself to create the hem and then folded the floral shell over top of the white to make sure that it was fully adhered. I wanted to make sure that I was using enough adhesive. I thought I was using an elastic for this, but I did not. So disregard that. Um, but I go ahead and apply it to the white part, push the white part down and then put glue on the floral part, and, or on the white part, and push the floral part down onto the white part. I let that sit for 24 hours, and then I went back and I flipped it down one more time together. Um, so I didn't separate the white and the floral. I didn't do anything like that. It was just a solid hem from flipping the white down. Um, and flipped it down one more time to make sure that everything was secure, everything was solid. Um, I wanted to make sure that it was not going to get, you know, ratty in the water or anything like that. Um, and the nice thing about Fabri-Tac is you have some play time, so if you get some adhesive on part of the garment that you don't want um, to be glued, you can kind of manipulate it to your liking. So just continuing to apply the glue onto the white part, flipping down the white part, and then flipping down the floral on top of the white. You could see that here. And that creates a hem like that. And then you just go ahead and flip it down one more time when it's fully dry to, like I said, extra adhere it and um, kind of clean everything up. I definitely don't, also I wanted to mention, I definitely don't recommend um, using your bed as your workstation. I kind of learned that the hard way, and I do have glue all over my bed sheets now, but whatever, I wash them so they're clean, and that's that. Fuck it, YOLO. So just rotating the skirt along as I go gluing more on the white
There we go, and then I'll go ahead and glue the floral onto the white. So after finalizing the skirt and letting that sit for 24 hours, um, or I should say while it sits for 24 hours, I worked on the bra part, um, or the top part, and pretty much did the same thing as well. Just glued it down, flipped it up, and then glued the floral onto the white. It was... It's honestly super simple, and I might actually end up doing this with other bathing suits in the future. I'm very happy with how it turned out. I think it looks good on. Um, it looks like it was purchased as a two-piece, so and that's kind of what I wanted it to look like. So as you can see, just applying the glue along the side, flipping up the white, um, or I should say along the hem, um, and then applying the glue along the white and flipping up the floral. So simple. I really enjoy Fabri-Tac. It holds well. There's no issues. And then continuing to turn it and do it again. And once that's set for 24 hours, I just go back to it, flip it up once more, and it's all good to go. I, I glue, um, glue, and then flip it up, and then let it sit for another 24 hours, and it is all good to go. I hope you guys really enjoy the video. Thank you so much for watching, um, and I hope you have a great day and a great summer.